right, so today I have a really awesome workout for you that I keep getting requested and I had no idea that it was such a big deal. Caps. I keep getting emails from people saying, Tracy, how do I tone up my calves or make them a little bit smaller? So I have some really great news for you and maybe some news that you're not really loving so much. So let's start with the maybe not so loving so much news. Genetics do play a role in the size of your calves. You know, some people, they just have shorter muscles, so that's gonna mean that your muscles are a little bit bigger. So if you're looking for smaller calves, you can tone them, you can make improvements, but they might not be able to go from here to here, okay? So, but we can definitely improve them, so that's the good news. Also, you know, depending on your build, if you're very athletic and what kinds of activities are you doing, that will also play a role. If you do a lot of jumping or you play sports like soccer, chances are that your calves might be bigger. Even dancers, who most people think have the most beautiful legs in the world, some dancers do have bigger calves than others. You know, the important thing is to love your body exactly where it is. And then the other part of the puzzle is your diet. If you're holding on to excess weight, your body is one unit, so your calves may reflect that as well. So I'm gonna share with you some really great toning exercises that are gonna give you lean, toned, and feminine calves, okay? So I hope that you enjoy this workout. So when we work our calves and we're trying to get toned and smaller calves, tighter, smaller, really feminine looking calves, we wanna make sure that we do lots of reps with very light resistance. So let's start with your feet parallel, right underneath you. can place your hands onto your hips here. Just shift the weight here so that you're just lifting up onto the balls of your feet. Use your abdominals for balance here, okay? So the weight is actually really rolling forward here. Small little calf raises here, okay? And that's gonna tone you up, okay? So keep going like that, lifting. You wanna do a series of, I would say, about 40 of these here, okay? So really going through. That's it. Keep on going, and you'll feel the, the muscles start talking to you, start burning, all right? So then, working at a different rotation, you're gonna rotate your legs to turn out, so you're in sort of a V position or first position if you took ballet. And you're gonna just, again here, lift up here onto the balls of your feet. That rotation, you're just working, you know, your legs a little bit differently in that rotation. Again, pulling in your abdominals. So again, you wanna work up to about 40 of these here. Your calves start burning, you'll definitely feel them for sure, okay? That's it, keep going, pull in the belly here. You'll start feeling your rear end burn a little bit as well, which is always a good thing, we want that. Good, so stay here and just hold, hold the balance, pull in, good, holding, 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 and let that go. Then, we're gonna separate your feet, externally rotate it, okay? Go down into a little plie here. You can use a little chair if you need for balance, and then lift up the calves here, okay? If you don't need the chair for balance, Place the hands onto your abdominals or onto your pelvis, whatever you like here. And you'll feel that from this, this plie position, you're really gonna get that toning in your calves here. Ooh, I'm feeling this. Keep on going, lift and lift. Good, let's do three more like that. Pull in the belly each and every time. So now stay here in the plie, lower one heel down, and then the other, and lift, and lift. Pulling in the belly here, lifting. Oh boy, I am feeling those calves burning here. So keep going like this, and up, and up. Excellent, up, and up. Good, you got it, keep on going like that. challenging, right? And excellent. Okay, good. So then, 
You'll do all of that just on the other side. So you can switch and walk around and lift up. Again, you want to do about 40 on each side. That's a good place to start, okay? Good, we'll do a few here. Keep pulling in your belly here. That's where your balance comes from. You'll feel that toning, tightening up the calf so it gets small and tight, very feminine, very pretty. And excellent. Then, for stretching, this is very, very important, okay? So you can just sort of step back and reach for your toe here, feeling that length through the back of the leg, very, very important, okay? And you can just lower the toes down and then do that again. You want to repeat that, obviously, do that on both sides. So lifting up, keeping your belly pulled in, lower it down, and then lift up. Another really great thing to do is just lie down and circle your ankle around just to keep everything really nice and lengthened and then reverse. So obviously do that on both sides, little ankle circles, okay? And then you can do this on a wall. I'm going to actually do it on my sofa. You can lean forward. So I've lifted my toes here and I'm just shifting the weight forward to stretch and lengthen the calf. Very important because we don't want a big bulky calf. We want a length and tone and feminine calf, okay? And then you do that on the other side. Good, and excellent. And then remember guys, so it's not just these toning exercises. You wanna make sure that you know, is it genetic, is it your diet, or is it that you're, you're, you're holding on to some excess weight here? And if you are, remember, some of the cardio workouts that you can do, you can click on my YouTube for free videos. I have my weight loss workout the best uh, fat burning workout, or how to get your perfect body fast. Those are three really great workouts. They're free, they're right here on YouTube. So if you're working on toning those casts, that's a great addition. So there you have it. These are some great tips, great exercises and stretches for you so that you make sure that your calves are exactly the beautiful feminine and toned calves that you want. And I really want to invite you to take part in my very, very exciting four weeks to your hottest body ever. We are starting again on January 13th. The registration closes on January 3rd. So just click on the link below for all of the juicy details. And as always, if you have any questions, feel free to leave your comments below or email me directly at tracy at tracycampoli.com. Bye.